two, one, power up. Autonomous kicks off for qualification match number 11. On your red alliance, we see all three robots inch forward. If they can claim that switch, they will get a ranking point. It looks like your blue alliance might have done just that during Auton. We will check out our scores coming down after the first 15 seconds. A red alliance lead, but the blue alliance does pick up a ranking point heading into Teleop. The quadrangles in red bumpers, they are the first to claim the switch in favor of your red alliance. Both teams accumulating one point per second for their switch, and it looks like Red has just picked up the scale. That's thanks to help from Galactech out of Columbus. Looking at our Blue Alliance 1792 round table robotics from Wisconsin, they try to neutralize the scale, but it looks like Galactech will be right back at it for your Red Alliance. Meanwhile, Shamrock Robotics, they are coming off of a great rookie season. They are working the exchange for your Red Alliance. Looking at our score with just over a minute and a half remaining in this match, a Red Alliance lead 140 points to 79 points, but we have got plenty of match left. It looks like the Blue Alliance is going two robots on that scale, Control Z and their partners, Round Table Robotics. Control Z with the neutralization, Round Table moving on in to tip the scale in favor of your Blue Alliance. Blue now accumulating two points per second. That will help cover the gap. 70 points separate red from blue. Just over one minute remaining in this match. Both alliances owning their switch. No power cubes placed in the vaults quite yet for your alliances. Once again, two blue robots are working on that scale. They are keeping it tipped in favor of your blue alliance. Control Z and their partners roundtable unfortunately drop their cubes, but they are still accumulating two points per second. The Red Alliance score now will breach 200 points. Blue Alliance with 165. The Blue Alliance will need to act fast. There's just enough time for them to make up the gap, but it is going to be tight between red and blue. Coming on down to our end game, 30 seconds remaining. Robots now racing toward the platform over on your blue side of the field. Red is coming back home. Shamrock Botics, they are first on the platform for your Red Alliance. A power up comes on in. That was red, a levitate. 30 points now added to their score that will lengthen their lead. 10 seconds remaining. One Blue Alliance robot is up on the platform. They are trying to climb round table robotics in our final five, four, three, two, one. Round table with 30 points for your Blue Alliance at the conclusion of qualification match number 11. Final score coming up on the screen for you now, a tight match at the end, but your winner is your Red Alliance. Red Alliance sealed the match with the Levitate played in our final moments, a score of 296 to 277.
and we are ready to get started and meet our teams for qualification match number 12. Starting us off on the Red Alliance, it's team 3176. They join us from Brownsburg, Indiana, Purple Precision. In the middle on the Red Alliance, it's team 868. That's the Carmel, Indiana Tech Hounds. Rounding out this alliance, team 4103. That's Rob Orioles from Avon, Indiana. Down on the other end of the field, one of our many out of state teams here today, it's 5531. They join us from Dearborn, Michigan, Orange Crush. Up next, we've got team 1501. Out of Huntington, Indiana, Team Thrust. Last but certainly not least, it's Team 1720. They're from Muncie, that's Fixed Gears. Have a thumbs up from the FTA drivers behind the lines. Let's 